I don't want to have to go get green peas surgically removed in the middle of a three month road trip. <laughs> Good morning, world. This is what I deal with all the time. Did something just break? Oh, I just opened this. I had a lot of momentum. Are you done? Button stab. <laughs> it's just a headbutt. Alana's trying to estimate how many peas, green peas, I could fit in my nose. What was your estimate? I think seven in each nostril, so 14. I think that's wrong. There's just a cave up there. I don't know how far it goes. I, I think we'll have to test this at some point. But you're gonna be a baby and you're like, don't shove it up that far. Well, yeah, cause I don't, I don't wanna have to go get green peas surgically removed in the middle of a three month road trip. <laughs> Excuse me, uh, I'd like to make a health insurance claim. Yeah, sure, on what? I got green peas stuck up my nose and I had to go get them surgically removed. Just because my girlfriend wanted to know whether or not her estimate of the amount of peas she could fit in my nose was right. Good morning, mountains. I'm scrolling through the weather to try and plan our hikes. Today's 27, Tuesday's 27, Wednesday 29, Thursday 30, Friday 32, Saturday 34. Boom, geared up with a day pack. Where are we heading to? Bear's Hump, up there. For those of you who aren't familiar with Waterton, Bear's Hump is like the easiest trail <gasps> to get sweet views from. It's about one kilometer to get to the top, but it's like 200 meters elevation, so it's just a steep, steady climb. Oh, it has a tendency to trip on literally everything. We're on a flat sidewalk, not even on the trail yet, and she's on the trail. You tripped on my shoelace. They turn our homes into ashes We fled out the back door We ran towards the city lights All the city lights Still not used to all this concrete Definitely one of the hottest days we've hiked in. Don't think it rains here much either. No. Other than your own sweat. And that it pours. That is dripping. That was an awesome trail, totally worth it. Not too hard, so that you see a lot of different people on it. There's kids, there's older people. Everyone's out having a good time. Definitely gets the heart pumping a little bit. But uh, it was a good warm up to get our, our mountain legs, which we do not quite have yet. No, we only have prairie legs. We found a nice little spot to have lunch. We have this bench all to ourselves. The parking lot was packed but this little trail doesn't have a trailhead or anything marking it, letting you know like Acamina Lakes this way. So it doesn't seem like anyone really comes over here. Yeah, it's definitely less marked and I think it's, it's probably because Acamina Lake isn't quite as like glamorous as Cameron Lake. So people kind of hang out there a lot and rent boats and stuff like that. So this is a nice, it's a quiet little Peaceful spot. spot. Little subalpine lake. And we got a nice little wooden platform here that I may have a nap on when I'm food coming. Mmm. <laughs> Sammy's featuring jalapeno Tabasco. Oh uh, yeah. And mustard. Pickles, cheese string, and turkey. That's the nice part about this trip. The fact that we're taking our time with beautiful parks like these is that you can take an afternoon, hike out to a little lake, have yourself a nice little nap, and uh, 
kind of cruise through the day, hiking when you want, chilling out when you want. We're probably gonna go check out the village now that you saw before from the top of Bear's Hump. Grab a cup of joe to get a caffeine kick after that nap, and we'll see what the night has in store for us. got a beer for once. Feels good after today. First beer of the trip. Tastes oh so sweet. That burrito and the beer, so good. Burritos and beer. So, so good when you've been eating. We haven't eaten out on this trip. No. Other than that one in W Burger after Pakasa. True. We did eat out then. But like, it wasn't, it wasn't burrito quality. It was like, but just, we need a burger. We're still cheap. Like, we split a $10 burrito. We did split a $10 burrito. It was still delicious. Oh, but the combination so of like the food, the beer, and the amount of sun we've gotten today, we're just in like sloth mode right now. <laughs> like we, we just ate the burrito and we just came and we sat down in the car with plans of like going and sitting under a tree. Now we're just super comfortable in the car. <laughs> and the plans of going and sitting under the tree seem like too much work. So we're just <laughs> sitting in the car. But the windows are down. <laughs> the windows are down. So we're still outdoors in it, I and guess. And there's still a mountain in there front of us. There is indeed still a mountain. I can't open my eyes, look. <laughs> I'm enjoying watching you try. This is the Waterton Village suburb life. Alana's convinced that this is someone's pet deer. We drove by him earlier. Like hours and he was ago. Just, and he was just chilling on someone's lawn. Mark, look beside us. There's ponies. We have pony neighbors at Walmart. Do you think they're living that hashtag van life? They're living that hashtag trailer life, which sounds trashier than van life. <laughs> I snorted, damn it. <laughs> that honey mark? I got that from her. I snort now, it's the worst. I don't think I snort that much anymore though. No, I have taken the reins on that. And yes, that was a horse joke, because there's horses. I think I can hear crickets. So we are back at Walmart, our, our home lately. Uh, we were just basically sitting in the car. We went to go drive to see a bit of a sunset. We decided we were kind of too tired and just too much, honestly, just, this is gonna sound like such a petty problem, but we had too much sun today. Like we're, you probably can't tell because I don't think it's fully developed yet, but we got burnt today, especially her, if anything, because she didn't put as much sunscreen on. My mom watches this vlog. Yep, she put a lot of sunscreen on everywhere. I put sunscreen on in the important places, but it wore off. <laughs> we're, we're pretty dysfunctional right now. I can't really think about how to end this. So, yeah, we're signing off. Subscribe, because you're awesome, and we're awesome, and we can kind of hang out through this thing we call the internet. And uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night, guys. <laughs>